Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. I want to appreciate you so much because of your continuity to support the work of this channel. Now, Orange Democratic Movement Party leader, that is ODM, Raila Amolo Odinga, has now dismissed the allegations that Mount Kenya region or Mount Kenya residents rejected him and voted for His Excellency William Samoy Ruto, who garnered millions of votes from the regions. And of course, Raila Molodinga still has come out to insist that Mount Kenya people voted for him overwhelmingly, saying that the figures revealed everything, revealing that it was a calculated scheme that showed he got few votes. Raila Morodinga has revealed that this is a calculated scheme that interfered with most of Azimio Laumoja, one Kenya uh, candidate in the mountain region that saw the majority lost to the United Democratic Alliance candidates. Raila Odinga still maintains he stand that the August general elections were tampered with that made him lose to Ruto. He has therefore urged his supporters to stand with him in these hard times that the whole truth will be soon revealed. And this truth that is going to be revealed, ladies and gentlemen, I want to say and I will repeat it many times. It is not going to be good when it comes to this leadership of William Somoruto. The opposition leader maintained that he will not be cowed by anyone and that he will reveal the truth at the right time. And that is what Raila Morodinga is giving when it comes to his uh, just a uh, simple and summarized speech. We know what happened. Just wait. This is what Raila Molodinga is saying. This is just a bomb that is bringing a lot of panic towards the government of William Samuel Ruto. This is what he said. We know what happened. Just wait. A time will come when the truth will come out. The people behind the scheme will be ashamed of their actions. Mr. Odinga said that. Raila Amolodinga also revealed that they will not be threatened or intimidated to join President Ruto's administration, which they are complaining of. And that is what Raila Odinga is saying. I think, according to me, no one will be ashamed, but if, were not, if they were not being able to be identified, how comes these people are still enjoying what they did? Ladies and gentlemen, I want to say that very clear. In this mentality, that now at least we are getting well with it, is that we were being told that everything was okay. But because I don't want to again injure the wounds that people are having, I want to go to the politics that is coming in 2027. I know when I say that, some people always tell me that, look, 2027 is a bit far. Can we talk about things that are going to happen? I want to say, nothing is going to happen Rather, whatever William Samaruto's government are going to do is to embark on preparing active politics towards recapturing the 2027 seat. And that is why he is now shifted, not being active in the state house, but now he's active now in the UDA headquarters. Now ensuring that they're going to disband these small political parties. Now they're planning to have just pure UDA. Or else, if it is not going to be pure UDA, they are planning to, 
disband all political parties, including UDA, and have one political party called Kenya Kwanza. But now, Raila Moludinga has come out very clear that, look, what happened, we have not forgotten about it. We know everything that happened. We know those people. But we are going to expose them at the right time. But this time, we don't want to associate with distracting the government of William Samuel And that is the same, same thing that Raila Moludinga is insisting that they don't want that when it comes to that time that they're going to question this government, this government is going to come out to say that, look, we did not deliver because you distract us. And that is why you see Raila Amolo Odinga is so much contented to the truth that he has that at the right time is going to tell the people that, look, these are the people that you are used to manipulate the election. You have seen that the revelation that he has come up with is that Mount Kenya region voted for him. He is assured, is having a hundred percent sure that Mount Kenya region voted for him. And this scheme that was created by few individuals that was surrounded with William Samaruto is that the truth has come to clear that this man, even William Samaruto, is not having peace at all. And that is why is busy complaining about Raila. In any case, I want to say that if today Raila Moludinga is the, 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 the later the Raila Moludinga, today things could have been in a hectic process. And I want to say this happiness that Ra William Ruto is having, the regarding Gashagwa, just calling Raila Moludinga every now and then, day in, day out, we Musewa Kuzumia. I want to say that these people are playing with a wrong person. I want to say it. These people are playing with the wrong person. They might enjoy that they won election. 2027, Raila might not vie, but Raila might ensure that they're going to block William Samuto in a way that is not going to create chaos, in a way that our country is going to be peaceful, as like the politics of 2007. So ladies and gentlemen, we are waiting what Raila Murudinga is going to do. And the plan and the timeline is that he was waiting that 100 days to elapse. And that day that 100 days is going to elapse, then he's going to do whatever he's, he promised Kenya that he's going to do. So, ladies and gentlemen, we are waiting whatever he's going to do. Perhaps we don't know. If you know, you can give your comment at the comment section below. Otherwise, I want to appreciate you so much because of great support. If you are a visitor, please subscribe to this channel. You put on the notification bell that when I upload my videos, you get notified. For those who are returning subscribers, I want to appreciate you so much. Bye-bye. Don't forget to like this video. Till we meet on another video.